Hey everyone, today we're going to check out the Ritual Gong Drum from Riot Audio. There's a few different snapshots, six of them to be exact, uh, that give a slightly different sound to the drum itself. Um, in general, it's kind of spiritual, kind of meditative sounding and, you know, a lot of ambience, but there's also some more dry type uh, snapshots as well. Let's check out the sounds and just see what everything sounds like. You can hear there's a really rich resonance and ambience there. Um, also, as you can see, let me pop this out real quick. Everything is velocity sensitive. So if you want, you know, like a really nice, uh, more dull sound or more muted, more subdued, uh, just lower the, the velocities there in your piano roll. And this is with no external reverb or anything, but you can hear what I mean by the whole, you know, meditative sound. Uh, it's it's very just, you know, ambient, very it's kind of spiritual sounding, for lack of better word. So you can hear with that one, even though we have, you know, a more energetic, faster uh, type rhythm, the 16th notes and stuff like that. Again, the, the resonance is there when you hit, uh, you know, different drums. We have the right hand and left hand programmed to different keys. So... You'll see right here which sample that actually triggers. Uh, let's go to the other presets. I think this one, yeah, this one's called Dry Muted, and it's going to be the more dry, obviously, uh, but more detailed and doesn't have that ambience. Moving on to the next snapshot, this one's called Quasi Reverse, uh, a bit more electronic sounding, you know, this is the most processed sounding one, uh, and I think it goes really well with the more dry, intimate sound. And then finally, let's check this one out. This is Hard Knock, which has a hard attack, hard transient, and then some of the ambience from the initial natural ambience snapshot, which is what initially loads up when you load the instrument. So you hear some of the different sounds that you can get from this. Um, obviously, you can just use it as kind of a very ambient library or a more processed, um, you know, going into some sound design with those different snapshots, which, of course, you can also achieve any of those sounds just by loading up the initial uh, snapshot and then tweaking the settings here from saturation, um, the attack, decay, the ADSR controls, as well as reverb and uh, sustain and stuff like that. So there's a lot of different uh, things you can do with it but in general it's a very simple instrument very nice sounding natural percussion but with a lot of possibilities to kind of process it and make it your own so that was just a quick look the ritual gong drum from riot audio i'll see you guys next time thanks